The FDA has the authority to regulate the nicotine content of cigarettes in the interest of public health, but it hasn't done so. The average nicotine content of cigarettes in the United States is currently about 16 milligrams per gram of tobacco. But if that concentration were decreased, would smokers consume fewer cigarettes per day or more? A large, double-blind, randomized trial was designed to answer that question. The researchers focused on adults who smoked daily and who were not interested in smoking cessation. 840 participants agreed to smoke either their usual brand of cigarettes or special study cigarettes. The study cigarettes had five different concentrations of nicotine, ranging from 15.8 to 0.4 milligrams per gram. The primary outcome was the number of cigarettes smoked during the final week of the six-week follow-up period. The smokers assigned to the three lowest nicotine concentrations averaged significantly fewer cigarettes during that final week than those assigned to either their usual brand or to the higher concentration study cigarettes. The three low concentration groups smoked 16.5, 16.3, and 14.9 cigarettes per day, while the usual brand group smoked 22.2 cigarettes, and the highest study concentration group smoked 21.3 cigarettes per day. The authors conclude that cigarettes with lower nicotine content reduce nicotine exposure, reduce the number of cigarettes smoked, and reduce nicotine dependence. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.